Um, and good morning, ladies and gentlemen. Welcome to NIIT India Conference 2022, the virtual summit. Man makes decisions and bold decisions makes a man. Experience says that transformative discussions and decisions are bold. And here we are, ladies and gentlemen, to discuss a bold approach, transformative learning for achieving business outcomes. To throw more light on this and the story of NIIT India Confluence, please welcome our visionary president for skills and careers business, Vimaljeet Singh Bhaseen. Thank you very much, Dilip. Uh, and a very good morning, ladies and gentlemen. You know, I'm absolutely thrilled uh, and proud to welcome all of you uh, to NIIT India Confluence. This is the fifth edition of NIIT India Confluence, uh, which is an annual and by invitation only summit of business, HR and learning leaders. As many of you would know, uh, we started NIIT India Conference in 2017 in a physical format in Goa. And over the last five years, uh, including the very challenging last two years, which made us move Confluence to the virtual format in the last edition, NIIT India Confluence has evolved into the most sought after platform for holding deep conversations on the role of learning in delivering business outcomes and building high performing teams and organizations. And while there are many elements of the story of NIIT India Conference, which I'm keen to share, we thought that the best way to experience a story is to revisit and relive those moments and take a stock of the many milestones we have accomplished and also the excitement which lies ahead. So we put together a short video to take us through the story of NIIT India Conference help us take a walk down the memory lane and also share a glimpse of what is in store for us over the next two days. May we have the video, please. Yes, Confluence 2022, like all Confluence in each of the past years, is bigger, 
better and richer than the previous one. And there are many dimensions on that count that I'm excited and eager to talk about, but I will hold my excitement and talk about a few for now. And we will talk about many more during the respective sessions over the next two days. First, the breadth of participation. We have over 300 organizations and over 600 industry professionals who are participating in this year's conference, either as delegates, speakers, panelists, or participants in the breakout sessions. And I'm sure each one of these 600 participants will be contributing to challenging and questioning the discussions which will happen over the next two days, all towards the same goal that each one of us take away some very relevant insights and learnings towards our journey of achieving professional breakthrough, building exceptional teams and exceptional organizations. Second, the depth of participation. The discussions at Confluence will be led by speakers from across sports, cinematic arts, and leaders from the corporate world, including over 20 CEOs and managing directors. The presence of such senior leaders also tells us how relevant these discussions are and the focus of heads of large enterprises on talent towards driving growth in their organization. Third, the diversity of discussions. Over the next two days, we will talk about diverse dimensions which leads to outcome-focused transformation, including transformation of the self, the team, the organization, or an environment, or technology-read transformation. During the next two days, we will hear Guneet Monga, globally acclaimed producer of movies like The Lunchbox, sharing her story of self-transformation and achieving breakthrough. We have Gary Kirsten talking about building teams, which not only have a winning mindset, but also excel in execution. And we have many notable business leaders talking about how they are navigating through these very challenging times, yet transforming their people and their organizations to maximize on the growth opportunity. And then of course, a very relevant theme, transformative learning for achieving business outcomes, which really connect all of these discussions together. To sum it up, the discussions over the next two days are broad, they are deep, they are diverse, and they are relevant. These discussions will help us establish how learning must demonstrate and deliver outcomes towards building high-performing individuals, teams, and organizations. And it is on this count, friends, that we have planned for our inaugural session 